Hello, hello there. How is everyone doing tonight? I hope you're all doing fantastic. Uh, I am excited for more Polybridge 3. Okay. I forgot to put on my hands and <laughs> was doing that last second. Uh, I'm probably needing to reprint the clip that I use. It's like starting to not be the right shape. So, weird. Uh, anyways, we have five stages left in Roll Top Avenue here. Uh, and this first one here is pretty interesting looking in that this one has to go here and down and this one has to go here and down. So, yeah. Oh! Something I didn't see while I was grabbing the thumbnail for today's stream. There's only two anchor points, and they're all the way down here. Tip of the hat. Is it... They, they both go at the same time. And it's only six pieces of... Oh, okay, so... That actually simplifies the build quite a bit. Right? Because we, we just want to do like... So there's this, and we get one, two, three, right? Oh, we get unlimited steel. Okay, I did not process that. Um, yeah, we'll do that. And pull this down to also get that. And sure, we'll get that and that. Okay, so that's this one. And then we need to build something else custom for here. And we get a one, two, three. Something like this. Ah, that one's tipping already. Uh, but first, let's go ahead and do this. Um, so we need to bring this in. This end needs to go up, and same with this end. Ah. Close for this one, but... I think I need another piece of steel here. Oh no! So close. We're just getting to the right spot and then we're going to prevent breakages. Okay. So on the breaking table, we are under a thousand here. Um, that piece is breaking, so sure, we make this a spring. Something like this. And then that. Please. You're almost there. Click. There we go. Okay. Oh. 
Hmm. Need that to stay rigid. But maybe we attach a thing to catch? Uh-oh. Uh, not that. This? Yeah, some, something like this. No! This one's gonna break now. Okay, what broke? That is cheaper, though. Yep. Uh, you broke. Can I make this spring? Probably not. Yeah, no. Uh, so we will make this steel instead. Oh, no, you couldn't make it. Okay. Uh, we'll do steel here, and I think we bring this out. Hmm. It's going to be interesting to figure out how to prevent... Breakages. Hmm. Let's make this wood, and then we'll see. No. Something like this? already wanting to tip. Hello, how you doing? Hope you're doing well. Needing to build some sort of mechanism to prevent this from breaking. I think the no-break solution is going to be way more expensive. What's the cheapest, like, no-break solution? 1400 Okay, never mind. What? <laughs> what is this? What am I seeing here? <laughs> okay. 
won't be here for too long because some friends planned a call tonight. Uh, but they aren't quite ready. Gotcha. All good. Hope you have a nice time in that call. No breaks? A break. And break. You. Something broke, but that's fine. You. Ah. What if we just do that? And then for this, we do that. Yeah, the left one breaks, but that's fine. Eating some blueberry donut holes you got from Walmart. We baked too much discount section. Jupiter is very curious. <laughs> nice. Uh, yeah. Oh, gosh. That sounds good. That sounds really good. Hand. <laughs> I swear, I look over sometimes and my hand's like way across my face. It's like, what's going on here? <laughs> But yeah, that sounds very good. <sighs> yeah, it definitely broke again. That. The steel broke. Okay. I need to watch as it's like hitting here. What's happening? Oh, the tip brushes. I think that's still brushed a little bit. Let me do that again. What if we just got rid of this part now? Okay. Hey, that's an unbreaking solution. Nice. Okay. So my problem all along was... Oh, here we go. That's why it wasn't working. Um, my problem all along wasn't that I wasn't, like, bouncing it enough. It, it was just brushing along the wall. That and that. This, yep, that will not stand. <laughs> nope. Yo, 
Yeah, we'll go ahead and do steel there. Hmm. Really? All the way down there? Okay, we'll go ahead and make that out of steel. Hmm. Ah, oh, it broke too early. That counts as a break. Yep. Shoot. No? Wood. Okay. That doesn't break anymore. Four hundred ten. That's pretty good. Can I do that now? Probably not. Oh. Here, let, let's try this first. No. Okay. This? <laughs> Yeah, too springy. <laughs> uh, if only. Ah, broke. Broke too early. Now this is a quadrilateral, so we'll do that and bring that more in line. Categorically worse. Did you did actually beat Pokemon Black 2? Nice! Yeah, congrats! Took a long break from it. Gotcha. Uh, so I think lowest on breaking is best. Yeah, we'll go here. Oh no. Ah. But very nice. I hope you enjoyed the playthrough. Like that end part there. Nice. Uh, we're just below, uh, whatever you'd call this face. <laughs> After playing them back to pack for a long time? That's fair, yeah. There is a lot of, like, sameness, sameness to them. Which can be, like, good and bad. Nope. That. There we go. Something like this. Hey, not breaking. Cool. 
You're probably starting more Pokemon games. Nice. Do you have any ideas of what the next game you're going to play is? Also, look at that. 111 on breaking. And 135 on the breaking charts as well. Let's see if we can at least get into the top 100. Yeah. Yeah, I saw that coming. Nope, way cheaper to do this. Coliseum. Pokemon Coliseum and Pokemon X. Are you doing the original... Oh, oh Pokemon... Let me see. Pokemon Coliseum. For the GameCube, gotcha, yeah. I I think I'm I saw a friend of mine play that at one point. Oh, my hand tracker just came out of its clip. Um I saw a friend of mine play that once, a uh, long time ago. And it was pretty cool, like what what I saw of it. I don't remember any of the details from it though. Yeah, I definitely need to print out a new clip. Um, maybe I get that started right now because it'll take some time. So let me go ahead and get that. Let me get that print uh, going. Yeah. Turn on the printer. <sighs> then menu, pay from SD card. We want Speed Motion 2 GoPro mount. We'll print at 80% speed. There we go. Okay. I'm here. I'm back. Wombo Combo. Hello there. Welcome on into the stream. Wombo Combo. From uh, the Melee competitions, right? Smash Melee. Device of Pokemon game, to be honest. Uh, you enjoy it, but it's pretty flawed. It's interesting because it exclusively features double battles. Interesting. Uh, Brad Scheitz? Uh, hello. How you doing? Yeah! I know some references. <laughs> uh, Load Bridge. Let's do Lois Unbreaking. You love that game? Nice. Yeah. Um, I'm not a huge Smash player, but I can definitely appreciate like their level of competition, you know? Um, so I I'm gonna say the same thing that I always say when this question comes up. Uh, it it's a little rude to come into a VTuber's chat and say, like, ask immediately, hey, show your face. Uh, <laughs> I I don't take huge offense to it, uh, just because I uh, I used to be a flesh tuber, so I did show my face, but I I just don't stream with my face anymore. There are some VTubers who do take big offense to that, and partially it's for privacy reasons and stuff like that. So yeah, it, it's. I, I don't really stream with my face anymore, but also like you shouldn't come into people's stream and be like, hey, you're a VTuber, you should show your face. Like that, that's not right. It's all good. Like, again, more of like a teaching moment, uh, not like me reprimanding you. Just, just letting you know that like, this could be an issue in some other people's channels and stuff.
Nope. You love my hair? Thank you. Yeah. Uh, this model is based upon uh, me IRL. I, I have this shirt and um, I have blue and purple hair and stuff like that. Yeah. And then the uh, mushroom is like a carryover from like my previous username. Uh, so yeah. Yeah. VTuber models are like an extension of uh, the person themselves and you like we, we try and get something that like represents ourselves, you know? I apparently chose the exact right spot for this structure not to break. I have no idea how I happened into that, but if I try and tweak anything, it's just going to break. So I'm not going to adjust that at all. Ah, broken. There we go. No! <laughs> Why'd you fall in the water? Ah, oh, you slipped backwards. A little bit more up? Wait, no, that's gonna cause it to run into the wall. A little bit more like that. Make it look so easy. Uh, I've been VTubing for almost a year at this point. I haven't had my one year, like, anniversary. Um, uh, um, I'm, hold on. Yeah, nah, fuck you. Uh, I'd use around this channel. People suck. And I'll leave it at that. <laughs> um, it, it's. They came in with a black profile picture and uh, you didn't say anything bad. Yeah, no, it was it was other person. Um, they're they were being transphobic. Uh, I, I'm um, I'm a non-binary trans woman, so they they were being transphobic and yeah. Uh, it it sucks. Like I, I've I've sort of gotten used to people being like that. We live in currently a very transphobic world, and that really sucks, to be honest. But um, yeah, uh, not a ton I can do to change that. So I just keep trying to uh, truck along and be myself. Yeah. Uh, I should also probably report this person. Report for... Let's see, report this one for harassment or bullying. And then...
Well, now that... Uh, weird. I can't prompt the other one. Oh, well. They are literally... Like, it, it's... You're such a sad person if, like, all you try to do is, like, make other people feel worse. Like... You could be doing so much with your life, trying to enrich yourself, make yourself a better person, make other people's lives better. But no, you try and make other people's lives worse. And that's just sad. Real? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um... I think we're going to do a little thing like this to try and spread out that weight a little bit. No, why'd you break? Stop it. Stop it. Get some up. Sorry, let me go back and properly respond to your message. Um... Uh, okay, VTuber stuff. VTuber stuff. Um, look cool, you've been looking into this stuff. Uh, make it look so easy. Yeah, I've been doing this for about a year. Um, and, uh, like, not quite, but I'm getting really close to that. Um, but I've also been, like, streaming in general for, like, seven years. And I've been doing YouTube for 12 years. Uh, so I, I have a decent amount of experience here. Um, in, in doing, like, content creation. I really enjoy it. I really, really, really enjoy it. Um, now, for for VTubing, like, I I looked at some tutorials, and I went and um, uh, I, I met with some friends who were VTubers, got inspired by some of them, uh, kind of talked through with them uh, to get the initial setup, and there was some jank. Let me tell you, there was some jank there. Uh, but we've kind of, like, worked through it, worked to improve things, and, yeah. Um, I was actually thinking about recently that I kind of want to talk through how I do, like, everything, top to bottom. Like, here's how I do OBS settings for streaming, here's how I do VTubing stuff, here's how I do video editing, like, all of these different pieces, uh, edit thumbnails. Like, I, I kind of want to do, like, a top to bottom of, like, here's what I do, kind of demystify the whole situation and, and then um, uh, it, it just make it really open and accessible for people because I thoroughly enjoy the creative process and creating something even, even if nobody else is watching I find it like deeply satisfying cloudy hello there how you doing hope you're doing well Um, let's try and bring this in a little bit here. You did, yes. <laughs> um, like, they asked if I use my face. And then it's like, you shouldn't do that. And they were like, oh, I'm sorry. They go back and find my face in like a previous video or something like that. And then use it as their profile picture. And then they're like, there's only two genders. It's like, stop. <laughs> uh. Yeah, very sad person. I'm, I'm gonna be honest. I'm gonna be real with you. School sucked for me. <laughs> but I'm also a neuro neurodivergent person. Um, I, I am diagnosed with ADHD. I'm undiagnosed with autism. Um, like, self-diagnosis. Like, school sucked. <laughs> uh, especially, like, start of... Um, like, end of 
uh, college, or, or sorry, end of high school into early college, um, I decided to have, like, the great idea that it's like, I'm really stable now. I don't need my ADHD medication anymore. And then I stopped taking my ADHD medication. And then it got so much worse. <laughs> so, yeah. That's not what your mom said when you... <laughs> Amazing. Yeah. So, yeah, just finding a way to express yourself. Like, what you do at school doesn't define you. Like, what you... What you choose to do with your life is what defines you, you know? Um, yay, trauma! <laughs> I, I enjoyed high school, but not, like, the school part. It was stuff with friends. And I enjoyed college, the part with friends, not the classes. Like, the, the first two-ish years of college were fine, but then, like, the latter two years, it was just, like, a slog. Really didn't like it. I'm so sorry to hear that. That's really unfortunate. Don't let the bastards get you down. Yep. <laughs> Sounds accurate. Can I make this cheaper by doing something like this? But then it won't reach far enough. But I could make it taller then. Something like this. Yeah. And then that. Let's just do this and that. Yeah, that breaks. We don't have enough weight to tip it over, so we'll shift this down a little bit. Your school has an LGBTQ plus club, and you and your friends are, get bullied for just trying to be who you are. <sighs> that that sucks. I'm I'm so sorry to hear that. Like uh, cool for the 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 club, but like, <sighs> ah, they're they're awful. Bullies are awful. He was the best teacher. Once convinced a student to come to school and do her work, and he'd give her weed. Oh. Okay. <laughs> uh, that's a story. Unconventional teaching methods, but it worked. Yeah. Sounds so. <laughs> It's not forward enough to start tipping, so like maybe I need to shift all of this out. Make it so it has more weight this way to start tipping. Your fiance was founder of the LGBT club at his high school, and while the school treated him like shit for it, uh, he made the school better for LGBT students going forward. Yeah! Runs the club is so nice and understanding, it's so nice to sit down and talk with them because don't know where you would, uh... Where you, where you would be without them? Is what I assume you mean? But yeah, just the finding your peers and being able to talk with them so good. So good. I I don't know if Yeah, I'm already over budget. Hmm. We might call this good. I got it. I I I had to sort of parse through and be like, hmm. 
I think this is what you mean. <laughs> okay. But pretty good. We got 110? 104? Oh gosh, what's 100? Oh, it's just 200 bucks. Okay. We'll try and shave that 200 bucks, get into the top 100. Mentioning LGBTQ stuff was illegal in schools. So because of that, you had an awakening later in life. Yeah. Um. Oh gosh, I, I memory coming flooding back all of a sudden. Um, in high school, I, I I have no like I have no recollection of what the project was about. But I was like, <laughs> uh, this is so funny looking back. I was like. Oh, here's, um, he, here's just like, uh, it, it was about LGBT, uh, I did a, a presentation about LGBT discrimination, like you were able to choose like your own topic and then you put together like a board and then like the hallways were lined with like all these poster boards and stuff like that where pe each person presented their own thing. And I did a topic about LGBT discrimination, um, I was either... I either didn't know for myself or I was still closeted at the time. I, I don't remember. My memory's awful. Um, so the, the details here are a little bit fuzzy, but I, I did this presentation and it's like, oh yeah, like I, I'm, I, I'm just being such a good ally talking about like, uh, here, here's how to, uh, here's like all the, the current like uh, all the past and like current stuff that's happening about LGBT discrimination and here's how we can be better about it um and and then uh the the the, the token lesbian girl at the school that everybody knew was a lesbian uh, like came over and was like yeah this is really well done <laughs> and then, then moved on <laughs> like Looking back, it's kind of, like, silly, kind of funny to think of, like, how closeted I was and, like, just how gay I am now, but, <laughs> yeah. Some of the only people? Ah, oh, unfortunate. Yeah, especially in some of the states, it's, like, really rough right now, and so sorry. One of my partners is a bit older, and um, they talk about, like, some of their experiences growing up, and it's... Things now are way better than back then, but things now still suck as well. <laughs> so, yeah. Yeah, keep being yourself. Exactly. Big agree with sound off here. See you next time? Yeah. People like you make the world go around? Aw, oh, that, like, that means a lot. That's really nice to hear, honestly. Uh, take care. I hope you have a nice day, and, uh, things do get better. Th things are better. I promise. Uh, surrounding yourself with people that you care about is, uh, one of the best things you can do. Yeah. Um, keep being yourself, and, uh, hope to see you around again in the future. Um, okay. Do we want to stop here? We could maybe tweak this a bit more. Hopefully, yeah. Definitely. Okay, take care. Um, let's see. Oh, this is providing a lot of strength. I didn't notice this structure before, but this is definitely helping to pull this weight down um and then also we have this structure here so um
such a sad person. Okay. Uh, do we want to try and like inch this price down more or just move on to the next stage? I chose hide user and channel, right? Yeah, I did. Remove that message. Keep trying, I got it. Okay. I did get, uh, last week I got a number three bridge for unbreaking. I wonder if I still have that. We're gonna take a quick aside. Um, this one. I'm pretty sure it was this one. Yeah, number three. I couldn't, like, optimize it anymore to, like, push it down further because that's, like, one and a half K, but... <laughs> I, I'm, I'm really happy with uh, that one. Right? That, like, before you got here, Cloudy, that was, like, the exact thing we were talking about. It's, like... Wow, that's just sad. <laughs> Come on. There we go. I don't think we can push it too much further, but... Let's see what we can do. Uh, let's redo this one here. Nice. Bucket fillers, not bucket dippers. I like that. How long am I on? Uh, I just started stream. Wow, gosh, it's been 50 minutes. Um, so another three showers. I, I, I stream four hours at a time, typically. When do I go live? Uh, I actually have a website for this. Uh, it's under my old domain name uh, or my old username. Uh, here, let me make a clickable link. Um, there we go. Clickable link. Um, I, I, I started work on updating my website, uh, to, to switch it over to crystal.envt.k. Um, gosh, I have a lot to learn with Vue. <laughs> uh, but yeah, uh, that, that's just a Google Calendar. Feel free to embed it and or uh follow it and i publish updates directly to that so yeah seven three three Very nice. Piece of wood here. Nice, that saved a bunch. Yeah, I love Helldivers. I, I played like 
three hours of the first game, and I really loved it. I really loved Helldivers 1. Um, I was mostly playing it with one of my partners, but uh, uh, I, I think she got like into um, DRG. Like it was sort of back and forth with DRG and Helldivers 1, so uh, I, I didn't play too much of that, but I'm really enjoying Helldivers 2. And the people that I'm playing with uh, tomorrow are very cool. Very, very cool people. Uh, yeah. Wait, this is more expensive? Oh, because longer steel. Uh, let's go ahead and do this and shorten this steel and then go to this. Ban button if you need to. Fair enough, Cloudy, yeah. Um, do go ahead and uh, there's also report and you can report for like harassment and stuff like that. So yeah. Um, got your stream deck all set up for stratagems? Nice. I haven't memorized my stratagems like for being able to repeat what they are right now, but like... I've started noticing some patterns, which is making, like, the inputs easier. Yeah, su such a good game. Such a good game. Just made by a little indie team, you know? Ah, shoot. Ah, there we go. Hell yeah. Okay. Nope. <laughs> Let's try and influence the weight to spread more this way. Ah. Team seems pretty cool. Even if capital G gamers have uh, decided to target them recently. Uh, yeah, true. It's... People are interesting. And, and that's both positive and negative. <laughs> Uh Yeah. Let's pull this down a tiny bit. Come on. What's holding you back? Is it this over here? Just do something like this, pull it this way. Something like this, maybe? That's broken. So we could just do this. I think that's a break, yeah. Uh. What's my favorite game? Um, I usually have a hard time categorizing stuff. Um, probably the game I had the longest hyperfixation on was Frostpunk. Um, Frostpunk, I like put three, here, let me pull up Steam to just show Frostpunk. So I put almost 300 hours in, and I have 107 out of 115 of the achievements. The last couple of achievements are like extreme difficulty, 
the 50 days extreme difficulty, 100 days, um, like harder, higher difficulty, 100 days in uh, endurance, extreme difficulty. Like, it's the tougher achievements basically I have left. I really love this game. I, I happened upon like one stream archive that Markiplier did of it, where he basically had people, um, Ooh, this is actually a good idea for... Uh, I, I'm planning a streamathon for my one-year anniversary for VTubing. Um, but he did a thing where um, people... Like, he put up a poll and the people voted for, like, what the um, law... Like, what law was chosen and stuff like that. Uh, and that made the game significantly harder because it wasn't optimized. But... Uh, I saw that and I was like, yes, I am fully into this game. I went and purchased it and then I got all in on it. <laughs> Frostpunk 2 is coming out this summer. I'm so, so, so excited for it. Be prepared to not hear the end of it. I will be talking so much about Frostpunk 2. <laughs> um, other games that I really enjoy. Um, Slay the Spire, Bellatro, really into Bellatro right now. Um, Super Auto Pets, uh, really love Super Auto Pets. Um, yeah, I like roguelikes, I like deck builders, that sort of stuff. That's what I like to play the most of, um, by myself anyways. Um, I like Legend of Zelda games, I like, uh, I, I'm a, uh, uh, I'm a variety streamer, so I do a bunch of different things. It's just sort of whatever I'm interested in. When is my one year anniversary? So the celebration is going to be two weeks early because I'm out of town the weekend before and the weekend of, but it is May 27th. Checking my video archive to double check that. <laughs> uh, January, February, March, April, May 27th, yes. May 27th is my uh, one year anniversary. We're going to be doing it two weekends earlier. So yeah. Seeing Housemate play Fallout 4 makes you tempted. Uh, apparently good too. Yeah, I saw um, Dune. Uh, not, not the show Dune, the person Dune. I saw Dune talking about it on Blue Sky and, and she was really liking it. So I... I I've only played Fallout New Vegas in the true trans girl aesthetic, you know. <laughs> Sounds great. Yeah, I'm, re I'm really excited for it. I'm, I'm currently planning it out with some of my mods. I think I'm going to invite in my partners next to help do additional planning. Um, there are going to be some punishments for me uh, if we reach certain milestones and stuff, such as like uh, the Bean Boozled Hottest Bean Challenge stuff. So yeah. It is legendary. It is also legendary amongst trans women for, uh, how gay. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Ah. Yes, of course. Nice. I think this is more expensive. Yep, that's more expensive. Shoot. <laughs> I I don't know, but <laughs> I I haven't played three. I I so I played it the last year of college, and it was like an entire school year sort of thing. It took so long to play through it. Yeah, there's a new Bean Boozled. Bean Boozled Spicy. Here's their store page. Sriracha, Jalapeno, Cayenne, Habanero, a Carolina Reaper. Oh my goodness, that steps up so quickly. Habanero, Carolina Reaper. Yeah, th those, those are like the two steps next to each other. <laughs> Just hate your companions dying? Yeah, me too. Really look forward to Frostpunk 2 just to see me play it? Yeah. Uh, I'm, I'm like, 
here's how serious about Frostpunk 2 I am. I might stop my Kaizo SMW series <laughs> just to play Frostpunk 2, like all in, like three days a week playing Frostpunk 2, like, yeah. Ugh. Let me try making this wood again. Hmm. There, there, uh, some of them aren't even secret. It's just like, you can do selective breeding. Like it, it's it's all just like uh, I'm not wanting to use the wrong. It's it's selective breeding basically uh, of plants to get certain traits. Basically, it, it's a science. You get a botanist who is very talented at their craft, and you can kind of get whatever plant you want. And that's how the red delicious became no longer delicious, is they just optimized for color. They stopped doing the deliciousness, they just went for color. For the taste test person, amazing. Too low. Hmm. Pull this back up a tad. Something like that. Ah oh, well. I think we're pretty good here. Three, five, two, one. No breaks, definitely. Trust me, you didn't see it break there. <laughs> Chilean strawberry and European. Yeah. And then, like, what we call a banana isn't the original banana. Uh, I, I, I don't even know, like, remember what term it would technically be closer to. But basically, the previous banana basically went extinct. Um... And, and, and banana candy apparently tastes pretty close to what the original banana tasted like, and not like what we currently have, basically. Help from above. Interesting. Um, so this is going to like swing around. What are we doing here? Here, let's check the process. So A goes B, C, D. So A. Hydraulic. How do I keep it balanced? Like prevent it from tipping over, you know? Like, is it just this? And then I go I'm going to build a really shitty bridge. <laughs> I'm, I'm being openly honest about this now. I'm building a shitty bridge because this is like the only idea I have right now.
Make that a split joint. This isn't going to lift it high enough. Um, you, you, you. Uh, do something like that. Yeah, no. Doesn't lift it high enough. Hmm. Help from above and you just heard, justice rains from above. Oh gosh, those voice lines are like baked into my mind, even though I haven't played Overwatch in years. Yeah. Darwin didn't... Oh. Uh, didn't realize that his wife, being his cousin, was inbreeding. Yeah. Ugh. I have to go. Oh, no. Uh, take care. I, I hope you have a nice evening. Yeah. Cheers, love. The cavalry is here. <laughs> Since the person got bored easily. Yeah. Oh, you can't ban me. Bans twice. Oh, I guess I'm gone forever. Uh, okay, dude. <laughs> Um, so I need to build like a lever arm or something. Okay. Ugh. I'm trying to think through this. So I need to... Maybe? trying to make basically a rhombus because with a rhombus you can kind of do a shift I need to go slower. I don't even know what's breaking here. Not that slow. I wish I could move this. Oh gosh, I... Okay. Um... Poly bridge hydraulics guide. There's like a specific thing, like a, a, a way to rotate based upon like one shape and stuff. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, definitely. Um... Hmm. 
I only have one hydraulic. That's less height. Uh, don't, no, don't clear everything. Just clear that. Oh gosh. Okay, so I need to build a mechanism that, uh, just checking my 3D print. Um, oh, it literally just finished. Um, I'm gonna wait for the print bed to cool down and then I will swap to that one. So I need to build a system that converts the amount of movement here into more than that amount of movement. So like advanced Holly Bridge Hydraulics. Everything Hydraulics. Okay. Advanced hydraulics examples. Okay, okay, here's the image that I'm looking for. Okay, so. Yeah, let's put this on the grid, right? So there's that. Actually, this should be rotated. So we have Actually, what what does this Never mind. I trying to do here okay I'm trying to think through the geometry so as this moves up I need that to I am, I, honestly, I'm a little bit overwhelmed by this stage. I, I don't know what to do. Um, because it's like, I need this motion to cause Is it this? Nope. This just feels like a mechanic that I don't know, you know? As soon as I do this, it's gonna break. Oh, it did not. Huh.
Mm-hmm. Okay. What do I do here? Also, Cloudy, don't worry, I took care of it already. Um... Made sure to report, thank you, yeah. My brain is like... My brain is so frazzled trying to think through how to make... Oh, hand tracking. Um, ha how to make this small amount of movement become like a large amount of movement, you know? Tenko, I feel bad. I, I I miss the stay safe from Tenko. Not much phases us, yeah. It used to affect me a lot more, but now I've basically just grown, like, almost bored to it. It's like... Eh. <laughs> I've, I've seen worse. <laughs> Um, yeah, here, let me, my hand tracker just fell off again. Let me, let me go ahead and switch. Grab this 3D print. Yeah. Oh, jeez. Ah. Okay. I'm back. I muted myself. No hands right now. Yeah, true. I'm uh just cleaning up this 3D print real quick. Gotta get, it's literally called a skirt. So I gotta get the skirt off of this 3D print. I'm using an older method of just using a skirt. Uh, apparently there's a new method called a raft where you print like, oh, I went to use hand sim, sim signals and uh, I don't have hand tracking right now. Um, you go and print a first layer. Uh, that's like a sacrificial layer and then you do your 3d print on top of that and it helps you get like a really nice smooth print look ma no hands <laughs> and there's plenty of vtubers who don't use hands they just sort of like they're here like this and more power to them that like uh, however like what tools you have available to you like you can be a completely entertaining entertainer without it like i mean i mean look at pank pank is an amazing vtuber who is just a png tuber but it's like a very expressive png tuber that they use and um yeah like they're they're an amazing um entertainer Heck, they introduced me to a new piece of technology like this week where they can share like a link to their, um, here, let's change to this screen. I'm, I don't have it there. I don't have my model there. Never mind. <laughs> um, uh, it, it's still the, the old thing. Anyways, um, 
they can link their PNG tubing stuff to me, and then I share that out, and uh, I can use it on my stream. And, and that's very cool, you know? Let's see. This is the old one because it's sanded. Here's the new one. But yeah, very cool stuff. Hank's very cool. You know, just because uh, on Twitch, we're going to do out shout out Pankaroo. Uh, go ahead and give a follow over to Pank. Uh, Pank is fantastic. And we're playing with them tomorrow. Screw it on in. I'm almost done, I promise. I'll be right back to more Polybridge. Okay, there's that. And get this back in its clip. There we go. I'm probably going to need to order some PETG uh, instead of PLA, but yeah. Don't worry, it's fine. <laughs> hands! Got my hands back on. Um, and then yeah, I'll take care of the scrap 3D print later. <sighs> it just, PLA is sensitive to heat, and this little hand tracking module generates a bit of heat. It's only 2.5 watts, but it's apparently enough heat that the PLA weakens, and then it doesn't like clamp on as much. So, neat, <laughs> gotta hand it to me, uh, appreciate the pun. Um, so PETG is more resistant to uh, heat, and so needing to uh, try printing this with PETG instead of PLA uh, for, you know, a better, like, actual, um, clip, preventing it from, uh, getting stuck. Or, or not getting stuck, preventing it from, like, weakening. It's not melting, it's just weakening. Okay, so... We need to build a lever. So it's like it's like this, right? So we gotta build a lever that when th this gets pushed up. It also pushes this up. By like a further amount. So we need to... <sighs> what do I do here? Like, I, I, the only thing I'm thinking is like a lever arm, so. Okay, okay, here's what we do. So this is here in the middle, right? But the fulcrum needs to be over here. So this is something like this. Fulcrum goes to here. Checking, does this work? Yeah, that works.
A lot more strength. This is basically the idea, right? So now we build out. So we don't need that piece. Just do this. Oh, and you know what? Instead of the end, we can pull to like the middle. Let's go ahead and try and do that here, right? Ah, oh, so close. Maybe we do one closer? Oh, nope. Oh. We did it though. I just had to think about how a lever works and it's like, okay, there's, a, what, what, it's like first class, second class, and then third class lever. Classes of lever. Ah yes, this is the wizard lever. <laughs> um, Yeah, first class, second class, and third class. Okay, so this is a, This is a third class lever because the load is at the tip and the effort is in the middle with the pivot on the end here. I, I, I literally, I was like going back to like third grade science class, like when I was learning about levers, it's like, gosh, what, what lever is this? How, how does this lever work? <laughs> going too high. Okay. Here's what I might have to do, right? Put something like this here, and this is what I connect to, and then I can adjust this a bit easier. Can I just do this? And then that would be this. Yeah. Hmm. Ah, so close. So it's just like slowly pulling it around. Ah. Okay, we're putting you out here. I'm gonna assume that was just that the forces were too much. Ooh, that's close. Um... Yeah.
Gosh. Okay. Trying to get this to like spread its weight out. Please. Oh my goodness. Okay. Here we go, muscle. Okay, new thing broke. So close, yeah. Okay, so we needed to pull it just a bit higher. Oh, come on. There we go. Oh, we did it. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay. 775. Top 30%. Let's make it better. actually make this straight line tool to there. Doom, 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 doom. Yeah! Wait, what? Oh. Too weak. Okay. Okay. Every once in a while, I think of this YouTube channel, CNB Minecraft. That's the YouTube channel that got me interested in Minecraft Redstone, and Minecraft Redstone got me interested in, like, getting into electronics and programming. So, like, literally that YouTube channel, like, changed my life. And the guy doesn't make YouTube videos, like, hasn't in years, but, like, CNB Minecraft. <laughs> it, it's it's so weird how like random people in your lives can like change things. Oh, I need to put this on my schedule. Sunday, I'm going to be playing some Pathfinder. Going to be playing some Bellfinder. Um, continuing with uh, a Gem Rourke. Uh, it's a it's a new like. March? West March? Like, a, basically sub-campaign. It's the same campaign, but it's a different sub-campaign. So, yeah, excited for that. Because of computer graft, you're indirectly responsible, responsible for getting people into programming? Yeah. The world is a weird place. A wonderful and weird place. <laughs> It's gonna snap. No, it's fine. And Minecraft led to your career, it's all just weird. Yeah. <laughs> Seven oh six. Uh, 
Uh-oh. Okay, so here's my cursed thought, right? Wooden rope. Wooden rope. Wooden rope. Does it work? No, not quite. We could try rope just at the tip there. They can work well, yeah. Wh Why? <laughs> Why did changing this one piece from wood to rope cause for this piece down here to break? Like, th this works fine here, right? This is fine, right? But then I change this piece to rope and suddenly this piece breaks. Yeah, the poly bridge butterfly effect is very weird. Yeah, okay, so this definitely has to be a rope. But these two pieces look like they might be able to... Nope. Those might be able to stay wood. We'll see for the way back down. It's slightly taut, and that's probably why it doesn't work with wood. Let's see if wood works here. Probably not. I think this is too much stress here. No, it's fine. Okay. So we might be able to make this one a wooden muscle then. Oh, that bounce. Ooh, that's very red. Okay. I realized that my hand tracker was pointing more down than it was supposed to be. Checking levelness here. Yeah, that that's about right. Okay. go. Nope. Shoot. Okay. Let's just go ahead and call this one good, you know? 
I'm pretty happy with where this one went. Do, 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 do. And that's the important thing. Yeah. And, like, even though it's the bottom 40%, this world, not as many people are playing, and so I feel less incentivized to, like, go for it, you know? It's time for a bridge review. <laughs> Let, let's go ahead and see what people did here, you know? Yeah, okay. That makes sense. Oh, and pull up less weight. Yes, I did. <laughs> Ooh, this one's cool. A double lift. I like that. Very cool. And it keeps it all balanced and stuff as well. I like that a lot. That's very cool. There's some jokes of his that, like, I still like and then there's other jokes of his that's like okay this might be continuing on a little long like the fish nato or whatever nato like eh. i'm i'm kind of over that joke personally <laughs> like it was funny the first time i was like oh yeah that that's really funny but then he kind of like he really pushes for that And he's very clickbaity. Oh, like his early videos weren't, but then like he ultra started like ultra playing into the um like clickbait meta and yeah. Unstoppable force. 40 meters per second. Okay. Yeah, it does. I'm, I'm trying my, like, as much as possible, I'm trying to subvert the algorithm. Like, I need to conform, like, certain degrees, but, like, in other capacities, I'm trying not to match with what the algorithm says I have to do, you know? That might be tall enough. It's gonna land about there. Sure, we'll do something like that. Okay, that's that half. And for now, just sort of bleh, something like that over there. <laughs> oh my goodness, it just starts going. <laughs> um, let's get a wall brace in here. Um, uh, I'm gonna give a little sneak peek for, uh, Tuesday's video. Um, so I played a little puzzle game called You Are Now Possessed. Um, it, it's just like 14 levels and it, it was a game jam game, but, uh, it was pretty fun to play. I really liked it. And, um, nowhere in the algorithm is that gonna be there, but, uh, I like playing puzzle games and apparently puzzle games do well in the algorithm because uh, most people just don't want to play puzzle games apparently and they just want to see somebody else play them. Um, which is fine, you know? I, I like playing them and I'll share my experience of playing them. So 
that's me conforming a little bit to the algorithm that puzzle games do really well, but also not conforming and that it's not like the puzzle game right now or whatever. You're right, that's why it's called Unstoppable Forest. It's not going to be stopped by any breaking bridge. Uh, let's go ahead and just do a real quick oop. Uh, <laughs> goodbye, car. <laughs> okay. Um. Let, let's just go with something like that, and we'll just do spring thing here, right? Whoa, okay. Hmm. Okay. Just goes right on through. That broke? Okay, we do that. Okay, that's better. Okay, I like this idea. I think I need to pull this back a bunch. Like, let it start slowing down, and then we go for it. Might be able to do it with just one. So let's give that a go. Okay. Ha! <laughs> yeah! We're 25k over budget, but it worked! Ah, uh, it broke? What broke? No. You broke. Why did you break? I might need to move where this is at. Why are you breaking? You know what? Let's remove you. Spring. Okay, it gets over just fine without that piece. Do we need that? We probably don't need this. Okay. Um, delete this. Nice, okay. So now it's just start trimming. 
Um, so each of these should be turned into rope. Ah, my back is all stiff today. I was sitting weird, apparently. At what point does this stop breaking? Okay, uh, let's try and make these wood instead. Okay, that doesn't reach, so we'll leave that and that. Hundred thirty. A thousand thirty. Okay. Um Let's move this to here. And we'll just do this for now. And then it's just... Copy to three, and we'll do that, 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 that. Is it getting warmer now? Um, yeah, that's what's happening. I will be right back. Um, I need to adjust my thermostat. I love this part of year. So I want to amend one of the ways I answered, like, questions previously on the Rad's R test. Uh, I definitely get overstimulated by temperature. I get, like, hugely overstimulated by temperature. Oh, it's, like, a degree or two too cold? Um, I, I just start, like, uh, like, I, I, I start, like, uh, having to stim, um, and if it's a degree or two too warm, same thing, I start like stimming and uh. It's like painful <laughs> to like have it be a little bit too warm or a little bit too cold when it's supposed to be like a comfortable environment. 
It's so weird. I did like camping and stuff like uh, quite consistently. Okay. Put that there, and then we run cable from there to there. And then... Yeah, hopefully that's good. Let's load lowest on breaking. this back. Look at that, we're almost under budget. <laughs> Unfortunately, that's not the end of it. Um, let's do straight line tool from here to here. It is a slight incline, but it will be fine. What happened here? Okay. Somebody that followed yesterday while I was off stream. Phoebe! Such a good username. I wish for YouTube... I could get like the same sort of like activity feed that Twitch has. Just like, oh, here's the list of people that subscribed recently. Cool. I would love that. Make this steel, and then we need steel there. No! Ah, so close. You. My one. Why'd I say that? I don't know why I thought that. <laughs> There's a lot of like little things that Twitch has that YouTube doesn't that would make my life as a YouTube, like I stream on both platforms, but like the YouTube part of streaming would be so much nicer if they had some parts that uh, Twitch has. Channel points? Seems like a small thing, but it would actually be really nice to have channel points. Just for like small little activities and stuff like that. Now, do I use channel points really well on Twitch? No, no, not at all, not at all. But it is like an important piece of the stream as well, I'd say. Can I do less here? Can I just do that? 
now. Can I do this though? Better yet, let's do two ropes. Uh oh. Hmm. Uh oh. But well, we're almost under budget here. Oh, uh, I need some of this for structure at least. Uh Hey, nice. We did it under budget. <laughs> Just barely, and look at that. We're we're bottom 17%, but we're also, like, top 1,000. Hey, Cable, stay in the correct place, please. I cannot wait for my parts for the slime VR to arrive. I, I hate the hands glitching out. Like, the fingers glitching out is one thing. The hands glitching out, oh, that bothers me so much. It's almost like I need to run two different leap motions, one for hand tracking and one for finger tracking because the, the leap motion two is significantly better at finger tracking, but it is way worse at hand position tracking, which is weird to say, you know? It does have wider field of view, but that's almost a hindrance because it, like, sees random stuff on my desktop and thinks that's my hands. Let's do something like this. Can I just do that instead? No. Can I get rid of this part? Hmm. Okay, there's a little tiny piece of road here, right?
Lowest budget on breaking. Can I just take this and make this do that? No, it just breaks now. Okay, I need to stand. Ah, I've been sitting, I need to stand. Ah, ah. Okay. Got my standing mat and I'm ready to go. I guess we'll go with that and it's other places that will try to do cost savings. Is this doing anything for me? No. So that saves a bunch of cost. It was doing something for me. Can I replace it with rope? I can. Do I want to go for lowest budget here? Do I? Sixteen six six six. Yeah, no, I don't think I am. Oh my goodness. Yeah, makes sense. Okay. Let's go on. Pillars of Strength. These go, and then this goes across. Oh, my only two anchors are what I place. Please, thank you. Okay. Uh, these are gonna break. Uh, so let's do... Big ol' pillar down. That and that. Hand, please. better, but that's still very stressed there. Uh, let me recenter this. There we go. Oh.
Hmm. Okay, good. Let's just go ahead and do this, right? Why are you breaking? Here, more support. More support. <laughs> Oh, almost. We're over budget. I have nothing beyond that to say. Whoa! Okay. Sure. Let's try this. <laughs> Bottom four percent. Hundred and seventeen. Yeah, replace what we can from uh, steel to wood. It's already on max fan speed. Fine, I'll turn this fan to max fan speed as well. Wow. 
Wow. That piece was doing more than I thought it was. Okay, let's do this, that. To help transfer some of it down into here. Okay. There we go. Our cheapest bridge so far. Let's go blue. <laughs> Whoops. Make this steel. I think one thing, when I get the better hand and finger tracking, I think once I started VTubing, I started doing a lot more stimming without realizing it because I'm not like as perceptible on camera. Um, so, might be, yeah. Uh, don't know what I was trying to say there. Brain empty today. Um, providing feedback on a comm that I'm getting right now. I commissioned this a while back. Some stuff came up. Um, Raid, hello! Cameron, how you doing? Raid, how y'all doing? Working on some uh, wacky bridges here. Some very weird stuff. A zombie Cleo emote, nice. Hi, I'm Cleo. <laughs> uh, that's not true. My name's Crystal. I'm a variety streamer who plays a bunch of different games. Yeah. Did some botany. Botany's cool. Like to hear that. Let's go ahead and give a quick shout out. Cameron JK. And we'll also do this type of shout out. Looks like that shoutout command's not running anymore. Did I disconnect that bot? I might have. I forget now. But it says it. Never mind. Whatever. Hi. <laughs> We're doing some weird bridges. Um, this one here, we only have these two anchors to work with. But uh, let's go to the campaign. So like, um, the first one was just like, here's all this road. It's all funky. <laughs> so we're doing a bunch of like really weird bridges here. Uh, first one we did today is just like these bridges that tip over and don't worry it didn't break trust me <laughs> You shout out, okay Oh So It seems not to be hmm Seems not to be running interesting uh, but yeah, uh, specifically, uh, Rosewolf, uh, and, uh, Archeator? Hopefully I pronounced that right. Uh, thank you for coming on over in the raid. Yeah.
so yeah, for playing through Polybridge 3, I try and get, at a bare minimum, um, everything under budget and unbreaking. Uh, I guess I can show this one, where um, I got... Uh, I got third in the world on this bridge, which is pretty cool. Little tractor rides up, and this game looks cool. It's very cool. I really, really enjoy it. Uh, this is Polybridge 3. So yeah, for uh, lowest budget unbreaking, I'm third in the world on this stage. So yeah. And I've gotten some pretty low scores, not as low as this one. This is probably my best ranking of all the ones I've played. Um, uh, but yeah, it's very fun. It's very chill as well. The music is so nice and calming, which is a really nice balance to um, a game that can potentially be frustrating. Yeah. Uh, but anyways, Cameron, if you need to raid and dash, uh, totally understand. That's normally, uh, pretty standard for post, uh, raid affairs. But, uh, yeah, uh, I, I appreciate you, uh, entrusting your community with me. So for this bridge, we have gotten a solution. We're just trying to get a solution that's under budget. Food needs you? <laughs> Fair enough, yeah. I think this one at least needs to be steel. We can have the inner supports be some wood, but I think the outer one needs to be steel. I did not mean to rotate the camera. Hmm. Do I use a rope here to help transfer the, some of the weight up into this? And then similarly here. Uh, yeah, similarly here. This doesn't look so promising. Okay, that's better. I don't think this is my lowest budget so far though, if I get this working. Yeah, no, let's look. Uh, it is lower budget. But it's also just not working. Okay. A, that's good, that's good. Bottom 6%. <laughs> uh. Do this? I might need to connect a rope here. Yeah, let's connect a rope here. That is slightly over budget, but hopefully good enough. Oh, what do we wish to do here? B. 
Because like I can do this. And move this up here. But that's like quite a bit more expensive. And doesn't even work. Let's just do this. might just do this. And then this? I don't know if that actually helps. The way that this rotates. Uh. Um, gonna head off as tired, though don't know how I slept most of Thursday. Literally was in bed for over 30 hours. Jeez. Uh... Yeah, good night, Cloudy. I hope you rest well. Feel better, friend. Yeah, yeah. Hope you feel better. Uh, this is worse. <laughs> uh, let's do rope at the end for these. <laughs> Trying to prevent this one from taking so much of the weight. But maybe it's just we do that and don't worry about it. Yep, there we go. That's our closest so far. Try to bring these up a little bit. Nope. But then we can bring this down a tiny bit. Let me bring this side down a bit. Okay, perfect. I think I'm going to reduce the length of that side. Something like that. Because that apparently throws off, like, the counterbalance and everything. No! Ugh. Polybridge butterfly effect. It is... a thing. That you just need to reckon with. There we go. Under budget. 661, we're in the bottom 31%. We'll try and push the budget a little bit, right? Not a ton, but some. This is probably gonna break. Snap. Look at that. Oh, we can use wood as under supports. Uh, let's go ahead and make that one rope as well. Nope. Boom, boom, boom. 
I guess I replace these with like wood structures. And hopefully it stays standing. That stays standing, okay. So I can probably replace all these triangular structures with wood. This one's taking a bit more force, but it's fine. So on this channel, I do talk, like, openly about, uh, mental health and stuff like that. So, uh, I, I did let people know, like, over on Blue Sky that, uh, recently I've been, like, recently as in past couple of days or so, I've been, um, in sort of, like, a mental health, health slump a little bit. Uh, just trying my best right now, and, um, something that's not great, that doesn't, like, super help, is, uh, earlier in the stream, the, some trolls came in, and, you know, that's unfortunate, but I'm just trying to make the best of the day, and, uh, the people I'm hanging out with, like, on stream, being in the moment, basically. Ah. I don't think I can use... Uh, I'll check, but I don't think I can use road there. I think that's too high for the truck. Yeah, definitely. Okay. 325... Is that cheaper or more expensive? If it even okay, it works. Is it cheaper or more expensive? It is cheaper. Okay. do that and then bring it down to there so what I'm building here are muscles this structure like two triangles butted up against each other that's referred to as a muscle and it's like the optimal way to um, sort of like double up material let's see if this works probably not but let's see yeah, I know. Okay. That lessens the amount of steel needed there. doesn't quite reach as double wood or a double road um can I just do that that 
That does work, but that makes it more expensive again. Do we need that piece? Wait, what? Okay, we do a piece of steel here. Yeah, that's not cheaper either. Okay. Hmm. I don't know what I thought was going on before. Am I going to pull... I might try and bring these together some. Because this is providing structure to this part, and then this is the muscle that's keeping the cable up. So it might not be strong enough, but... <sighs> Is there a straw that broke the camel's back? Okay. So that needs to be there. Maybe we can pull in the, these left ones? Yes. I was able to. Okay. Mm. Let's try that as well. I might be able to make this just one piece of road here. Let me try that. Not quite. Okay, cool. Saves quite a bit of money by not having like additional supports and such. Eclipse. I have no idea how people do coloring of their usernames. Some sort of trick, probably. Uh, Steam color... No, there's color codes for Steam, apparently. Well, I found an example, uh, but also the, the the example that they give is like really awful. But that's what you get for Modern Warfare Two, apparently. Uh, <laughs> um, Interesting. Okay. Uh, but top 27%. Do we just want to push for 250? I think that's a fair thing to push for. 101, 999. We can 
probably do that. Okay. Try steel cable instead. Cool. Let's try this. Nice. Smashed it, actually. Any other clever optimizations like that? Nah. I could do that. If it works. Why'd you break? I'll need to check if this is cheaper or more expensive. That is cheaper. Okay. Um, We beat 250. We're top 25%. There's not many people playing this world, so I think that's good for now. Let's move on. Um, Let's actually check where we are in the campaign. Last one. Okay. Counterweight. I'm confused because this area up here cannot build outside build zone. So this is all of the build zone here. So I th this is another lever action thing where we need to have Okay. We need road to exist here to here, right? There to there. Clear, clear. Um. Bam, bam. Okay. So this needs to go up by other stuff going down. It doesn't have to be by much, honestly. This can be the fulcrum here. Um, I, I, hmm. Got this and this. Okay. So that's pretty well supported. Yeah, that makes sense. Uh, steel here to here. 
Make this steel. Make that steel. What's going on here? Why isn't it rotating? Slow this down. Okay. Cable? Okay, so this is in the balance. Is it because of the spring? No, the spring was keeping it in the balance. Okay. What's heavier? Here. Nope. One road down. Point three five one. Okay. So this is definitely more expensive. Really? Okay. Ah, the new shape it doesn't like. Please, 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 please. Uh, yeah. Okay. Up they go. Unlock secret worlds. Hell yeah. Secret sheep. Okay. Right. 
Up they go. Okay. Bottom 3%. We're at 900. Let's get a steel going across there instead. Whoa! Okay. Changing, changing this also changes that. Like what the balance point is. Good to know. That, that makes sense, honestly. You know what? We do straight line tool from here to here with steel. And then we do... Uh, actually, we need this straight line tool here to here. And we make it three segments. And then wood, 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 wood. Quite a bit higher. Under budget. Um, even higher? Huh, weird. Even more so. <laughs> Interesting, it swung higher, but didn't stay as high. Uh, oh. Um, and please. It's like finding the rhythm of the pendulum to like perfectly deliver it. Bottom 22%. Can I make this wood? I could probably make this wood. And then probably make that wood as well. Probably make this. At least this part would up here. Shift this over here. Yeah, we'll just stay with this for now. Whoa. Please, 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 please. Okay. No! <laughs> Pendulum timing. Ah. Shift it along slightly, ever so slightly. There we go.
Nice. Okay, time to make this wood. Okay. Yeah, this isn't taking much force, so we could slim this down even more. Like, it just sort of needs the structure to exist. It might not. It's taking a little bit of force. Yeah, that's taking more of the force. Okay, just because I'm curious. I mean, if this can take the shock. Yeah, we get rid of that as well. Optimizing something that didn't even need to exist. Delete this. Okay. Three thirty-nine, top thirty-seven percent. I can probably make this, that. I can probably make this, that. Might not be able to take the shock there. Bam. Yep. But I might be able to make just that piece of steel. Hmm. Nah. Make this whole thing steal. But I might be able to ship this along this way a little bit. <clears throat> Reduce the amount of steel. Bonk. Okay. This is taking basically no force, so I can do a wooden rope. Except it doesn't go under tension in the same way, so I guess we won't. You know what we could do? We could bend this out slightly and then do a wooden rope? Then it is under tension in like a normal way? Now we just try and find the minimal weight for what we're trying to do.
do that. Okay. Knuda, hi there. How you doing? Hope you're doing well. No, don't break. Oh. That's gonna break for sure, but come to hug and love on the crystal. <laughs> Video's frozen? Oh no. Um Hmm. I'm having a handful of drop frames, and that's because I changed like some of my Recording settings? It was on your end, gotcha. Yeah, I'm recording three videos at a time instead of just one. <laughs> okay, that broke. We can try a piece of road instead. <laughs> um, so I'm recording this screen that you see, and then I'm recording my VTuber model with a green screen behind it, and I'm recording just the gameplay. Uh, and that's going to make editing for myself and my editor in the future going to make it easier. Um, so trying to improve workflow stuff to, uh, it, it does mean more video I need to save, but it's going to improve workflow immensely. Make it so that we can get like cleaner shots and stuff like that. Uh, top 300, very cool. Top 33% as well. What's 250? 21512, that's quite a ways off. No! Oh, come on. Please? No. Hey, okay, we're good there. Cool. 297. Um... What about road muscleage? Is that cheaper or more expensive? That is more expensive. Okay. Trying to find the best timing with the lowest budget that we can get. Uh-oh. Maybe a little bit more we delete. Bit more? <laughs> nope, okay. Okay. That seems just about the minimum that we can do. Oh, but that wasn't our cheapest. Okay. So we go to this. This was our cheapest. Cool. Okay. And that is 
uh, the final stage of Roll Top Avenue. Let's see what some other people did here. Oh, interesting. Very interesting. That's cool. Oh. <laughs> we... <laughs> Alan. <laughs> Interesting, yeah. So I had a very different solution, but it's sort of the same idea. Like, you need to start out, like, lower and then rotate up, so. Yeah. I'm pretty happy with my solution. Okay. And we have unlocked... The Forgotten Realm. So let's see what this world's all about. Hey, $69,000. Nice. Interlaced. Can I... I can't connect to that. Wait, this is connected... What's gonna happen here? Um, sure. We'll bring this down. We'll do bucks. And we'll do that, that, let's see how well this works, maybe, maybe not, nope, not at all, this needs to be lower, copy and... Copy, paste on top, put you over here. Okay, it needs to be like half height. So somewhere around here-ish, I think. Okay, but then I'm wanting to redirect to another spot. My only anchors are these dynamic ones that are moving. So needing, wanting to do something like this. I almost need this. I almost need this, like, straight up and down. Yes, ish. Rings, perhaps? Yeah, that seems about right. Um, gosh, okay, that piece not, isn't needed.
Okay, I need to mount this, like, on... Excuse me. Undo. I need to cut. There we go. Overlap overlaps with building shape. Okay. Oh my goodness. Okay. Very interesting. Very weird. Okay, so when this is here, kind of to the left of that. Maybe I just do that to stop and hold it for a bit. Yeah, there. Okay. So, copy and flip horizontal. Something like this. That's not quite right. Maybe it is? Let's see, it's rotated 180. So this is a 180 rotation. So... I think I want to rotate it a bit this way. Spring, and then I think I need to just road out. Uh oh. Um, so this to there. Uh-oh. Hmm. Okay, maybe we hold off on this for now. And then we figure out a different grabber. Yeah, let's do that for now. Okay, so this is another stop. Like that. Uh, maybe I make this piece separate. And then I can do... Just 
something like that. Oh, this is gonna flip. Hold on. Why is that still doing that? three pieces go up to here yes no yes no I don't know if this is a good or bad design <laughs> I think I can move... I can move this to the left. And still get the desired effect. I do that. Okay, okay, and then... Yeah, nah, that's not gonna work. Oh wait, hold on. New plan. Okay, gotta lean up that side. Okay. Let's 
Like this? Pull this down. Oh. Um... Sproing? No. No, 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 no. Um... Double steel. And I think we need a spring here for landing purposes. Ooh, that went behind the plane. Nice. Oh, I see what's happening. Get rid of that. <laughs> nice. Okay. Bottom 39%. Uh, we can work to optimize this, though. something like this and nope that does not survive uh, let's go ahead and make some of these road uh, you can't be road so we'll make you steal you could be road. Uh, just requires a little bit of a shift. There we go. Another piece of potential road. Okay. Hey, don't even need the springs. Bum, 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 bum. Top 750-ish. Oh, right. Um... Has to be steel because road cannot intersect there. Okay. Um. Hmm. Over this way a bit. Okay. Cool. We might be able to make this wood. That's a little bit of cost savings. Very nice. What part does this actually land on? Does it even use this last one here? Yes. Also, they're headless now. Let's just make this wood here. We'll make this wood here. Wood. 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 Yep, kind of to be expected. 
with spring. Bit of spring there too. Oh, come on. This is still cheaper, but. Um. Something like this instead. Okay, good stuff. We might even be able to cut off one of the roads on the end. Can we cut off this one? In which case we can probably just do... Come on. Yeah, something like this. Nice. All the savings we can get. Also, I want to comment on the sky. The sky is very pretty in this world. Here, let's just pause. Oranges with like deeper purples. I guess as I zoom out, it doesn't change, but I really like this sky box. Um, kind of matches my aesthetic here. <laughs> Saxmith, hello. Saxmith, hello. <laughs> My, my brain, my, my dyslexic ass has been inserting an S every time I'm realizing. Sex myth. <laughs> Hi. How you doing? Hope you're doing well. Uh... Ooh, hold on. That's how it's pronounced. Gotcha. Okay. Uh, how am I doing? Um, I I'm doing decent. Uh, I am. Uh, I I'm fully open and honest about mental health stuff. Um. Here and and so. I I am currently going through a little bit of a uh, depression and uh, anxiety bout. I don't know what brought it on, but it's here. Um, and then there were some shitty people earlier in the stream, you know, some trolls, but, uh, right now, at this moment, doing really well, and by and large, things are going well, even if I'm dealing with some mental health stuff right now. Thank you. Okay. I might... Oh my goodness. Somebody just built over the entire stage. Pfft. It's just a bunch of swings. Uh, great. I love it. But I saw somebody build... 
Where's it at? Here we go. Here's the one I saw. Yeah, just build across the stage. It's fine. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Let's move on to the next one. Smash course. Uh... One's gonna need to go over the other. 10 horsepower, 30 horsepower. Okay, so this is going to be the overpowering one initially. So we put one wall brace here. We put another hand, <laughs> one wall brace over here. I'm having issues with my hand tracker where like it's seen something on my desk and thinks it's my hand, but then it thinks it's not my hand and it kind of just flutters and oh, it's been really annoying. <laughs> Okay. But because it's encapsulated like this. Yeah. Hmm. What? What could we do here? So we need to do something to allow one to drive over the other. Hmm. So it's probably going to be like a an arch arched road. Something like this. And then Uh, let's get this on the other side as well, and then we do another arch here to here. Okay. It is sagging under its own weight. Not good. Hmm. So maybe we want the opposite. We fully support the outer edge like this. Okay, so it's these cables that broke. Switch them out for steel. Steel cables. Okay, so this didn't really change anything, it just made a more expensive bridge. Hmm. Okay. Uh, I'm going to really quick switch from Standing back to sitting. Eh. Mm -hmm. 
trying to do more standing um, in my health journey that I'm on. Uh, back to this screen and recenter. There we go. Hmm. I... So this is 12 polygrams, this is 13 polygrams. Is this something like where I build two, like a double decker thing and then this like drives up and will just kind of plop down whereas this one will push through? Uh, this please. Something like this, and then springs here, and I guess here? But that's probably going to break open. And we'll do this, and we should probably do the same on the other side just for the support. Let's see what happens. Uh, not good enough. Shoot. Probably just something like this for middle support. Uh, double middle support. <laughs> This is still too short, and I think I need to build something like this, and then like, I don't know, some compression system over the top.
What what's happening here? Why can't I move it up? That's a building? What? What the fuck? Okay. Go, go, go. You can do it. Mm. I don't think this is it. This piece that's breaking. There, extra support. Maybe one more road? Just one more. Ah, oh, my brain's so fried right now. I... Like, am I aiming to build a full... I've built so many levers today. Way too many levers. I think this is hitting before this can tip over fully.
No, worse, it's hitting on top of it. So we need to make this steeper? Question mark? <laughs> We need to go steeper. Oh. Okay, let me change where this fulcrum point is then. We change it to here. Yeah. Let's go ahead and do that. I am way over budget. I am horribly over budget. Ah, oh, and then it, it bonked into there. Oh, nope, I, that's not what I meant to do. What if we remove that? Because apparently that's not working. bus almost arrives, or whatever that vehicle is. Gosh, it's still gonna come crashing down. But hey, I beat the stage, look at that. Just has a bunch of breaks in it. Um, I think I shortened this by a bit and I need to lower that back down. Oh, no. Uh, let's remove the auto triangulate. Thank you. 
I might need to revisit this next week because I am a little bit at a loss of how to properly handle this. Uh, nope, I meant to go with steel. Maybe I just put springs in here. I think I definitely need this well supported. And so it's this next piece that can be springy. I think. Do something like that. Something like this, where I put this above and then it will spring down. Oh, come on. I'm really not seeing the solution here, if that's not clear. <laughs> Yeah, we're getting close to the end of stream, and let's probably just take a break. <sighs> oh? Nope, okay. Oh, well. Um, yeah. With that, I'm gonna say uh, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the stream. If you did, and you're not already following on Twitch or subscribed on YouTube, uh, that would greatly help out and help make sure that you can see the future streams. Um, tomorrow, I will be doing a Helldivers 2 collab with um, Pank, uh, Callista Dragon Soul, and uh, Kai Siri. I'm really looking forward to it. Uh, it's going to be a good fun time uh, helping deliver some managed democracy and all that. Um, and then, yeah. Uh, next week, uh, oh, sorry, on Sunday, I'm going to be doing a Pathfinder, Pathfinder campaign off of this channel uh, on the Paladin Bells channel. Uh, so, yeah. Thanks for the stream. Yeah, of course. Super happy to do streams. Um, th this is my favorite thing in the world. I, I love streaming. I love making videos. Uh, this This is what I am truly passionate about and uh, people supporting me uh, while I'm doing it uh, honestly means the world to me. So thank you for uh, spending your precious time with me. So yeah, 
Thank you. Um, for the Twitch folks, let's go ahead and find a friend to raid to. Um, Twitch.tv slash following. And we'll go to the live channels. Yeah, we're going to raid once again over to Vic Switch. Um, we'll be raiding pretty consistently to her for a while uh, due to her streamathon, and uh, she's aiming for six 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 hours uh, of total streaming, like a total like presence live time. She, she's not including the time that she's asleep. So that like that's twenty seven days if you included the sleeping time. It's much longer than that, so uh, please go and send all of the love over to Vic Switch. Uh, she's amazing and a huge inspiration to me. Yes, the for Forever Stream 3D. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Again, take care, everyone, and I uh, hope to see y'all tomorrow for some Helldivers 2. Okay. Take care. Bye-bye.